I've got the Samsung Galaxy S21 Ultra right here. And today I'm going to show you how to boot this phone as well as the Galaxy S21 and the Galaxy S21 Plus both into download mode as well as out of download mode. Now with some of Samsung's previous devices, we were able to boot into download mode without the need of a computer or a USB cable. Even though if we were using download mode, we were most likely going to connect it to a PC anyway. However, that's changed recently and that includes with the Galaxy S21 series as well. So when you're ready to boot this smartphone into download mode, we need to power off the phone. You're gonna feel the phone vibrate when you do. And once that does, we're just gonna wait a second or two before we proceed to make sure the device is completely shut down and that it's not just the display that's turned off. When you are ready, we can go again, make sure you have your USB cable ready and that it's connected to the PC while it is turned on. We're going to press and hold both the volume up and the volume down buttons at the same time. As you can see, I just pressed both of those down. And while those two buttons are held down, I can then insert the USB cable into the USB port. And eventually you'll see the display light up and take you to the blue splash screen for download mode. Once we get here, you're going to see some instructions right here. We are able to press the volume up button to continue to bypass the splash screen and continue booting into download mode because we're not actually in download mode yet. We can also press the volume down button to cancel and that's going to not reset the phone like a data reset. That's going to cancel as in restart the phone and it will boot you back up into the Android operating system. Or we can press the power button, aka the side key, to display the barcode for the IMEI number. So once you get to this screen, all we have to do is press the volume up button to bypass the splash screen and enter what is known as download mode. Now again, we're able to do a lot of things in download mode, such as Unlocking the bootloader, we're able to check the status of Samsung Knox. We're able to check the status of things like factory reset protection, OEM lock. But more importantly, it enables us to connect the smartphone to the PC program called Odin, which is what norm most people end up using to flash or install Samsung firmware files to the device. Now I do want to point out that even though this says do not turn off or do not disconnect, it's completely fine if you go ahead and disconnect the USB cable right here. That is, it's fine as long as you're not currently flashing something to, with Odin. Now if I had opened up Odin on the PC and I clicked that start button, while the device is connected, then I do not want to unplug that USB cable. But if we're just simply booting into download mode for, again, for instance, to check for OEM unlock, the factory reset protection, or just to check on the NOx status, it's fine if we unplug the USB cable or turn off the device. They even give us instructions to on how to restart the phone. So that is how to boot the Samsung Galaxy S21, S21 Plus, and S21 Ultra into download mode. When you're ready, we can just follow this these instructions here. We just press the volume down and the power button at the same time. And if we do that while we are in download mode, that's going to force the device to restart. And that should boot us back into the Android operating system. 
So that is how to boot the Samsung Galaxy S21 series both in to download mode as well as how to boot out of download mode.